Okay guys, so let's do a what would you do Wednesday. Ingrid was taking a much needed exhale after committing four years of her life to ungrateful, self-serving beast of a woman. At the start, when Ingrid was 32, she lost her mind for the gorgeous, intelligent, 36-year-old divorcee Simone. Ignoring how crazy quick things were barreling, they let their chemistry vault them into cohabitation, which then immediately led to it playing the starring role in the decline of date night and communication has been shot in the foot. So, Ingrid lovingly embarked on a mission armed with the best intentions, I swear to you, to talk to Simone to see if they can get things back on track. However, it turned out that engaging in conversation with Simone was like trying to open a jar of pickles. Plenty effort, little to no results. So, on top of that, we had the difficult time of stomaching Simone's ability to turn anything into a big to-do. I mean, just an uproar. No matter how good things are going, no matter how good a time is going, Ingrid, I mean, Simone could just flip the script and just totally kill a mood. So Ingrid was stomaching that on top of everything else. So what I was able to do with Ingrid were, was to connect the dots between relationship, di relationship dynamics that were going on around Ingrid's conception, what she witnessed growing up in seeing relationships around her, and then the way she was behaving in previous relationships. And in carving time alone, she assessed what we discussed. She considered whether or not she should continue the relationship, and then at one point she introduced Simone to me. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, unfortunately, Simone's ability to be accountable was on vacation while Ingrid was doing the accountability cha-cha on her own. So basically, this concluded with Simone coming home to an empty place one day, just wondering how Ingrid had stealthily pulled off the greatest disappearing act in history. So my question is, what would you have done?